when it's when it's dark, you see so much more out in the in the forest. It's amazing. You have all the spectators. You have the barbecue. You have the smoke on the track. You are sitting in a GT3 R car. It's really loud, but you still can can hear the music. This this was unbelievable. The rain has arrived. The 911 had a, a, an incident on some some dirty track or some oil. Omar had to pass a car. Not his fault. He could not avoid that. It was the leading car. Three minutes. Nine hour 45 to go, and uh, we are leading. Coming from far after the, the issue on the first lap. There's a close fight going out there with the Mercedes and a few other cars, hoping to stay around the front for the next 12 hours. We just have to survive and uh, try to keep pushing until the end. The race has obviously been red flagged for fog in the end. We restart after the red flag in position order. So it's basically a fight out between the Porsche and the Mercedes. It's flat out from now on in. Unreal. This is unreal. This is the most difficult race in the world and uh, we win. But I cannot find the world for it. I think it was a centennial race. Unbelievable circumstances with the red flags, with the one, one and a half hour sprint at the end. She's so proud of the team with the puncture from the beginning. I mean, it was really tough, but we never give up. Everybody did a perfect job. We all think it was possible, all drivers, all the team. And we say, just keep going until the end. You never know what can happen. We all want to work together and uh, we fight for each other every single lap. Trust each other. I have really no words, but it's a big day for Porsche. 